We love hip hop. Drake writes a cease letter, uh, or sorry, writes a, writes a letter for a ceasefire between the beef between Israel and Hamas. We sure he, it was his his. <laughs> we sure it's his signature. You know what I mean? Like, well, you know, listen, I didn't get the look through the contents of the letter, but remember, he was getting pressure from yeah, um, but he just did that like TV. Who, he ain't gonna stop shit. It's not like Drake could stop shit. But remember, they were like, "Yo, Drake, Vlad." Okay, um, now he did it. Now he it? did it, Vlad. What's he do? What, 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 yo, they <laughs> yeah. just bombed three three hospitals. Yeah, that's what I was on, saying on, last on Saturday. Time. On Saturday, yeah. on Sunday, yeah, yeah, went yeah. hard in the paint. So I don't know. I don't know it that really that that one. Shit. Yeah, it yeah, doesn't change no shit, man. No influences. Yeah, you just getting the man now put up in some 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 politics. And you know what's crazy? He got backlash after. The, um, you know, putting his foot forward finally, yeah, and say because rather than saying, okay, let me support one side or the other, peace. Let's Is all it, have peace, yeah, like, but, bro. I don't see anything wrong with that, right? Yeah, but people found something wrong with that because, <laughs> bro, they just—it's just—it's just a bunch of people fighting over something they don't even know. Right. So I'm gonna but pull up something on the screen over real. here. Um. Let me see if I can make it a little bit smaller here. One and second. he know it. He know what they. He know what where, where it really comes from. What he what his religion is, right? He know where it comes from, right? Well, so, he's he's Jewish, right? In a certain in a certain aspect, yeah. Well, but like I feel like it, isn't it? And listen for the my Jewish people out there. Let us know if you have any part of you Jewish. Aren't you Jewish? No, if, if your mother is Jewish, you're, you're Jewish. You're Jewish. Yeah, right. But it's it's also what part? What kind of Jewish? You know what I mean? Mm. You yeah, know what I mean. Yeah, yeah. they say what they say. They say Zionist. They say they say uh, there's Ashkenazi. Ashkenazi. There's Mennonite. There's all types. Yeah. They, you know what I mean? And then there's twelve tribes, and they say it's two brothers that split apart. And you know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. I don't want to get all biblical on them, right? But yeah. y'all know, y'all know the rest. Yeah, yeah, so yeah. he knows. He knows. He's around a lot of. Um, Caribbean influence, you know what I mean. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. So he knows he's been in those con- those that room, that, you know what I mean, in those conversations. Yeah, yeah, you yeah. You know, yeah, like yeah. how does it feel to be that? And not, and do you know this was we were the first, or do you know like something? You know what I'm saying? Like again, people get political with it, right? Yeah. So but I feel like he to, he lives more of the black experience than, of course, because he was Jew- shunned, and just the way he looks, like Drake. No matter what people say. Um, him being biracial, rah, 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 him being Jewish. When you see Drake, you see a black guy. Yeah, you see a light skinned black guy. I bet you more Jewish people hate him than 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 black people. Yeah, yeah. Just I'm, that's, this is why his crew is the way they are. Yeah. Growing up, even like before that, like the guys that he was meeting back in the days, like yeah. he was getting accepted by black people. Oh, yeah, but his own. Yeah, in a sense, right? Okay, we're all mixed, yeah. mixed up in some way, right? So it's like. That, that's not gonna hold me back from being friends with my my boy who who celebrates Hanukkah. Yeah, you know what I mean. <laughs> like, that well, ain't dude, gonna hold me back. Everybody was on his head top. He finally said something. Yeah, and now he's still gonna get he still gets backlash because it all. says here Israeli woman or Israeli woman gets mad at Drake because he called for a ceasefire. And she said this. So he should be there in his rap song. Silent for weeks about the massacre of his fellow Jewish brothers and sisters in Israel. But this week he called for a ceasefire. Drake, you have no guts. You have no identity. Wow. You don't know who you are. You've spent your whole entire life, what? like most people in the world, proving to everyone and to yourself that you're special. We love hip hop. This week you proved that you're ordinary. You don't know who you are. Big <laughs> whoop. You can make some good music. When it comes to things that matter, you have no identity. You will do anything to be famous, to have friends in Hollywood, to make money, to be successful. You couldn't say anything about Israel until it was officially cool to say something about Israel. The ceasefire. There will be no ceasefire until Hamas Uh, is destroyed, until our hostages are back. You are a coward. (laughs) You are such a disappointment. She's going in. She she sounds like she has a lot of, like... No, a lot it, of that is anger toward herself. Is she, because she because they don't know who they are. Yeah, they don't know who they are. <laughs> whoa, 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 whoa. Let's so not get into that. Let's, get into, let's not get into that. Let's not get into that. Yeah, it was right, dog. Yeah, it was right, dog. Listen, 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 listen. Don't make me have to cut nothing out of this episode, my G. 
The sill. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right. All right. <laughs> but look at her. Look She's at going her. off. She went in the paint off. Well, the thing is, this is what this is what we were saying before in a few episodes ago. Why say something? Because either way, you can't win, my nigga. You yeah. say something, somebody on one side is going to get <sighs> cheesed. Right. And the man wasn't even like saying one side or the other. He was just like, Yo, everybody just chill. She wanted a rap song of him like spinning the block <laughs> on Palestine. That's what she wanted. And yeah. that's going to make him a non coward. Yeah. You make good music. That's crazy. But, yeah, yeah. But you didn't spin the block on Pal- like, Palestine. Like, uh, come on. Come like, on. Fam. That's what she wanted to hear, bro. That's crazy. Because you're asking for too much. You're fam. asking for way too much. She wants blood. She wants this nigga to go and go write a, 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 a Palestine. Uh, sorry. A, a Hamas drill song? Yes. She wants him to spin. <laughs> like, yo, no, fam. Yo. So they can do their dances, bro. Come on, fam. I think I think he did the best thing. Just yeah. call for peace. But it, yo, yo, no one's gonna learn until this thing till till everything is like really tragic, bro. And I, that's all I'm saying. You know what I'm saying? It just sucks. We ain't gonna learn until it's all tragic. It sucks because peace, it's easy to say, yo, everybody, you know, just let's be peace. No, it's not. When everybody's doing there's so many pain and lives lost on one side it's like the, it's like the streets yeah. you try to tell these drill niggas to chill they're like fam this nigga popped my friend like broad daylight in front of in front of everybody yeah <laughs> and you're gonna tell me to chill chill doc i'm spinning so i get that part but still fam it's not the worst thing to tell people like when we tell these drill rappers yeah. maybe you all need to have some peace no we're not trying to tell you forget all of the stuff that happened but <laughs> like if you keep on continuing a cycle, yeah, we're never gonna stop killing each other, fam. Yeah, and we we do our own genocide, right? Yeah, and we're, we're the ones. I I was thinking about it the other day. I'm like, oh man, they got us good. They made us make rap music and just mess us up. Brag about it and stuff, bro. <laughs> they mess yo. They're like, yo, how do we just destroy this shit? Yeah. And they did a great job. So I'll give them credit. When it comes to something like this, yeah. like, I get where she's coming from, where it's like, she you do? I get where she's coming from. She doesn't, she's like, yo, fam, what do you mean, peace? Like, yeah, I, no, right? I, I kind of do, but I kind of don't. She's being broad with it. Like, okay, with our culture, we're sneaky. Mm. We ain't going to be on what well, we do. Sorry. <laughs> we do get online and be like, <laughs> they'd be calling out their ops, right? Yeah. She's doing the same thing we do. So that's crazy. So, is, you know what it is? serves them right too in a sense you know what i mean because like because i think it's now they're you're showing they're showing their true colors dog because why would you want to be if you if that person's living there too in the same place they can still get bombed too right true right so like why would you say, say that because that the same thing you're saying can happen to you you know what i mean so yeah, yeah. I, i'm and i know how whatever they're saying on the other side they could be saying right but it's like it's not going to be easy to tell people to just say peace and no war and peace in the Middle East and all that. Nah, dog. This is our tax paying money. Yeah. You create, there, there's no way we can, they're going to stop that. They already, we, they already put our money there. Yeah. And it's not easy there's to There's two say wars going peace. on, my dad. Yeah. There's actually more than two. I feel like. in, in, and there's one in um, Congo. Yeah. Yeah. Like, yeah, bro, yeah. Yeah. Bro, the place yeah. is mod right now. There's there's multiple world wars going yeah, it's, on. It's honestly it's inevitable. All right. War. Yeah. Just I, like conflict in general is inevitable. To have everybody on the planet, all eight what eight billion, seven billion yeah. people, whatever, to all be on the same page and agree and have maturity with that. That's insane. And respect, man, it's not like what it's happened? inevitable. Yeah, that's yeah. hard. There's always gonna be a power struggle. Yeah. Like Yeah. So, Got one madman sit down like, yo, how do we take over the world? Yeah, you know what I mean. And then they display their weapons, and yo, there's places where they're 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 displaying. They have a parade for their weaponry. You know what I mean? Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. It's on like Donkey Kong in certain places. Like they're showing like we have this up. We'll yeah. blow up the place. Play with us. You know what I mean? So people are trying to go in there and play superhero. Yo, man, this place this place going crazy. Yeah, you know what and, I mean? and they, then they want people to pick a side. That, this is what she's on. She's on some pick a side shit. Yeah, but boy, right. yeah, her whole, whole argument is personal. Yeah, it's but not, I think all no of it. Like, I think it's a whole culture of Matt of just people who are upset. Let's just be real, right? Yeah. Mm-hmm. Right. There's a whole bunch of generational trauma, dog. So we're not I, like as black people, we're not the only ones going through it. But 
it's kind of like we're not involved this time. You know what I mean? I'm just being real. We're not really involved. Yeah. For yeah. once, right? Because I've <clears> never <throat> seen nobody come jumping up when 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 the kids are dying out here on the streets like this, right? Yeah. Let's just be real, right? We get it for like a day or two and that's it. Yeah. Turn the next page. You know? Yeah, nobody's blasting off saying, yo, somebody should say something for Chicago and then having this kind yeah, of energy. Yeah, and blowing up, blowing up. Not to, sorry, but not to say it, like blowing up police stations or whatever they're doing, right? When a cop kills another black person, we're not doing that. Yeah, yeah. Or they're not even doing that for us, right? So- I'm just being honest. This is an ancestral thing, right? Mm. Uh, and they already done claimed what they want to claim of land that was Africa anyways. So I'm just going to stay out of this one and let let God decide cuz God's watching on this on this on this end, you know what I mean? Yeah. He yeah, watching. Yeah. I'm not even he source is watching. Like I'm not even I I, I think know? Drake shouldn't have said nothing. And he shouldn't have said a damn he thing. He shouldn't know, say no, cease, nothing. Just this is how when, when um, Vlad was on his head top about like say something, he yeah. should have just stayed silent like he yeah. was. Salute to 40. 40 was out there um, speaking his part. He's out yeah. there using his social media. Yeah. Different members of his team could do that. But him, the guy, yeah. just leave it alone. Let everybody else talk about it. You know what I'm saying? You mm -hmm. ain't got no responsibility to have to say something as an entertainer. And then now you got people like saying, little small minded people. Well, you know what? That don't really matter because like, okay, let's just say it was another high profile uh, Jewish man mm -hmm. or woman coming like that at Drake. Then it would matter. You know what I mean? Cause they'd be calling for a cancellation, a cancellation because the man wants peace. That's the craziest that, that, thing I ever heard I mean, in my life. Exactly. Bro. So they can't show that though. If there's a real like entertaining entertainer or big, big person who's Jew, they can't show that, that yeah. they really want this place annihilated deep down inside. You know that, what I mean? That would be a crazy public display. Imagine this, okay? Drake comes out and he's like, yeah, yeah, no more Hamas. Bomb them all. Spin the People block. People would be like, yo, what is Drake saying? Spin the block. Yeah. Oh, This is what she wants him to say. Smoking on a, on a Palestine pack. Like, what? People will be like, what? Be, what? It doesn't even matter about him losing his fans or whatever. People look at him like, yo, are you crazy, fam? Just say peace. Yeah. And I know he has a <laughs> lot of, he probably, and he has a lot of Arabic friends too. Yeah. I know he has a lot of, a lot of friends, man. So he can't, but they know he, where he comes from, but they know also where he comes from. And you know vice I mean? versa. If he was Palestinian and he came out as Palestinian Drake and he was like, yo, all you Israelis, ah, y'all can get it. Like, People will be like, yo, Drake's going crazy. What's wrong with him? Why yeah. is he going barking off on the on, yeah, on TV know, like this? I wouldn't, wouldn't want to. Ah, man, I just feel bad for him because at the end of the day, he's just probably just. He just had to say something. The man's on vacation. bro. <laughs> yeah, but he's probably watching. He's he's, but, he, but he's watching. But he's watching his own. Like, OK, in a sense, his people them blow the blow people up right now yeah, on some yeah. so he's like yo y'all gotta stop cease fire this is crazy yeah you know what i mean to his people he's saying that shoot up drake <laughs> yeah they're like yo <laughs> yo me <laughs> what <laughs> what yeah yeah bro but salute to drizzy man they're like keep it kosher dog and and listen i will echo that sentiment cease fire everybody just chill you know what i'm saying yeah man yeah. um we love hip-hop hip -hop.